this video, I'm going to walk you through setting up assistive access for your students on the iPad or iPhone. First, check that you have updated to iOS version 17 under General. Then scroll down to Accessibility. You'll scroll all the way to the bottom to Assistive Access. The first time you do this, you will be prompted to set up an Assistive Access passcode. Customize your view into Rows or Grid. Next, you will select the apps that you want your student to have access to. Click on Manage Apps and scroll down, selecting each app with the green plus sign to the left. Some of these apps have already been optimized for assistive access, such as Calls. You can select a limited number of contacts and have the option to only use a speaker. You can also specify the way you want your student to interact with the camera feature. Within Messages, you can select contacts and the way that the student will send messages, such as making messages audible or using videos or emojis only. Once you've decided which apps you want to use, exit Manage Apps and click on Start Assistive Access, entering the Assistive Access passcode. At this point, the screen will go black for about 10 seconds. In Assistive Access mode, the user will have enlarged icons and limited access to different actions. I really love this feature for students with visual or cognitive impairments. To exit assistive access mode, simply triple click the top button and then select exit on screen.